Hello everyone and welcome to Peachy Plays, the 3D adventures of Sailor Moon. You might not have ever heard of this game before because it is almost 20 years old. This game came out in 1997. It is suggested that you play it on Windows 95. It's ages six plus by the way. This took me forever to get this to actually work on Windows 7. Uh, I haven't played this since I was a teenager. Oh my god, this intro. This intro, you have to- I haven't watched this whole intro. Oh my god, you guys. This is going to be horribly hilarious. If this even plays. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Are you ready for this? Yes! Yes! Look how fantastically horrid this is. But at the time, 20 years ago, this was the shit. This was the bee's knees of 3D technology. This is the living exercises. <laughs> yes! And dem graphics, and you can sing a lot. This was freaking cutting edge, this 3D, you guys. <laughs> you wanna see the crystal transformations with these models? Look at Barrel, look at her! Tucked in the creeper in the bushes. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Oh no! Queen Barrel has her hands on the Sailor Scout's transformational items. No! <gasps> Welcome to the 3D Adventures of Sailor Moon. Your mission is to uncover the Sailor Scout's hidden transformational items as you explore the various play areas. Click on the cats, Arnimus or Luna, if you need help. Anytime during the game, <laughs> you can quit by clicking on the quit button. Have fun! Have fun! Where do we start? Okay, so we are gonna start out with uh, with some more crappy CG, and we're gonna go right here. I believe this is the the fashion show, the runway. Oh, we have to load. We have to load. This is the Moon Fashion Salon. Bam! Moon Healing Escalation. Welcome to oh, Sailor Moon's no 3D loading. Fashion Salon. Take some time in the oh, most reputable yeah. saloon in town. You can visit Sailor Moon and the other Sailor Scouts <laughs> and admire their super fantastic costumes. And what is wrong with their head? Oh my god. Let's do Mercury. Oh, oh, even this music's even better. Da -da -da. Sailor Mercury always loves to wear blue because it's her favorite color. Her hair's like a blob. <laughs> oh, this is fantastic. <laughs> it really was Isagi. She tripped down the runway. <laughs> Alright, Mars. Let's see what she says about Mars. Sailor Mars looks good in red, which is the symbol of a dedicated fighter. <laughs> she is a pro! <laughs> oh, you guys' comments are the best part about doing this. Alright, Jupiter. Sailor Jupiter wears green to fight against evil forces with the power and force of a thunderstorm. <laughs> because look at her shoes! <laughs> Because thunderstorm. <laughs> she <laughs> so strong. Oh my god! <laughs> you guys, you guys are killing me in the comments. I met this female. <laughs> oh, I met this female voice actor. <laughs> what places? All right, all right, Venus. Oh, Tux is gonna be the absolute best. I'm fucking dying Sailor over Venus here. Excuse orange, my language. Because she is a dynamic fighter, whose special weapon is a powerful beam of energy. <laughs> She's like forever looking up. They're looking up at this guy. Okay, okay, okay. Are you ready for Tux? Are you ready for Tux? Are you ready for this? This is Tuxedo Mask in his famous fighting tuxedo outfit. As you can see, <laughs> black is his favorite color. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys! Oh, the 
chur <laughs> charged money for this. <laughs> Look at how his chest sticks out from like his stomach. Here is Sailor Moon in her fighting uniform. Click on her now to see what else she can wear. Click on her now. Okay. Yeah! And so here we have the typical dress up and these like snap into place. So we can dress her up like Sailor Moon! Yay! It's not even colored right! The moons aren't yellow! Yay! Yes! Okay, that's what it is. These- I thought- I didn't know what these arrows did. I thought those went to the other characters, but no, the arrows give you more outfits. Yes! Yes! He's actually got a lot of clothes. Yes! In case you wanna disguise yourself as, like, a grandma. Okay, here's the greatest part about Mercury. Does something appear to be missing? Because... It looks to me like something's missing. <laughs> yeah, she lost her bow in a battle. Oh. My. God. <laughs> They're like, it doesn't even match. Like, it's like... Doesn't even snap right to her body. Like, you can see her bra. Better put an apron on. I don't even know how to handle this. <laughs> this has got her symbolized. She's just, she's advertising that she's Mercury at this point. Oh, there's her bow, but it's on the same side that you can't put her bow on her and that at the same time. Plus, the bow doesn't go here. It goes on her head. Oh, yes. Ray. At least she doesn't- at least like her face like it kind of looks like they actually took a picture from the anime. Like Mercury was all like stretched and okay at least she has her bow. She has her gloves. Da, 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 though that doesn't work at all. But for some reason we also have blue and green shoes or if you thought that Mars always needed boots there you go. Oh my god, doesn't it, Steve-o? This looks like one of those like fake rip-off games like that was made in China or like made by a fan who just tried really hard but doesn't really know that much about programming. Yeah, because those two things totally go together. I don't what I don't even there's no pants over here, like Ooh, there we- okay, that's probably the only, like, really legit good thing that, like, there's actually, like, artwork of her in something like this. Like, that's probably the most fitting thing that is in any of these dress-up games. <laughs> oh, you guys are killing me. I wait to ignore the cat in the bottom right-hand corner and she tells you what to do. Dress up your favorite character. Click on the arrow button to get a whole new group of outfits. You know what's Take the extremely by clicking sad on the part? Film strip. That the voice right the there screen, would have been a better icon. voice than the deep dub version of Luna. Okay, I, I just want to see what pose these people are going to be in. It's great. Oh, damn! <laughs> Work them little panties, Mako-chan! Yeah! Sexy girl! <laughs> oh, just except- well, I mean, it's pretty appropriate that uh, that's all she's wearing. I s s oh, okay. She's ready. <laughs> Sexy Sailor Jupiter. Yeah, girl. Working girl. <laughs> she doesn't have parents to tell her no. Alright, let's see what else is on this side. Oh, damn, girl, yeah! <laughs> she don't need no shirt. <laughs> working girl, working girl. Yeah! Give you some beads. Yeah, oh my gosh, Paul's Paul's a bird. This totally looks like one of those free kiss doll uh, programs that they used to have for downloads in the 90s. I totally had a ton of those. And there were Sailor Moon ones much, much better than this dress-up game right here. She's got nothing but like panties <laughs> and pimp outfits. Like, couldn't they have actually, like, watched an episode of the show and tried to, like, recreate one of those outfits? Like, what is this? Have you ever seen her wear anything like this? And there's no shoes. We have to go over here for the shoes. Move on to Venus. We gotta look at this Sailor Venus wears orange this is Sailor because chin. she is a dynamic right fighter. His <clears throat> special weapon is a powerful Sailor beam chin. of energy. Let's see what your pose is, Sailor Chin. Are you sexy? You are the goddess of love. Yay! Okay, that one looks actually like 
an anime character. Like, we finally- Whoa! Hey, baby. How's it going? And there's no way to make her, like, not- It just snaps on there. There's no concept of, like, space. I don't know why the pink shoes or the giant boots are over here with uh, the Venus Fuku. At least she has a bow, though. And like I said, at least this one, like, she's actually in, like, a cute pose. Her dimensions actually kind of, like, look like an anime character. Oh, she doesn't have the right shoes. She has the same boots on both sides, and she doesn't have orange shoes. She has pink shoes for some reason. Oh, we have Artemis down here! I want to hear Artemis' Dress voice. Up your favorite character by clicking on the clothes and dragging them to their appropriate locations. If you click on the arrow buttons, it will view a whole new group of outfits. To take a snapshot, just click on the film strip. You can print the outfit on the screen by clicking on the print icon. <gasps> could that could that recording have got any more breathy? <gasps> oh my god! I don't even want to see the rest. I can't. I can't. I'm not going to be able to handle tux. Oh, I think I clicked it twice. Why is it taking so long? Oh my god! <laughs> the tent! <laughs> this is weird and it's gonna get weirder! We have hot air balloons and stresses. I mean, what is this? Them pixels, you can see those pixels. Sailor Dominic, this, yeah, this is, this is, this, if there was a, um, you know how there's like a dark, I can't even unselect this. <laughs> I clicked off my game trying to unselect that. I don't even. Oh my god. I lost my cursor. Hold on. Dress up your favorite character by clicking on the clothes. Oh, I lost and my cursor. To their appropriate locations. Oh my god, my cursor. I can't get my cursor back in the game. Hold on. <laughs> the dress is so big. Artemis can have a secret base down there. <laughs> I'm not even clicking on those again because that broke my game. Okay. This is cute. This is cute. That's not bad. It kind of looks like a bag. And the overalls, except for her boob poking out and her not having a shirt, and them textures of like a dead mouse and bones. <laughs> okay, that goes back to her Sailor Fuku. Oh. Oh, you guys. You guys, these textures. These textures. They hurt! They hurt! Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Is that- is that all? Have we gone through everything on this side? <laughs> Will it never end? <laughs> Will it never end? <laughs> the 90s it hurts! Okay, and we're back to Sailor Dominatrix with her broken leg. This is Tuxedo <sighs> Mask. Block you. <laughs> This is why we don't let America do anything with Sailor Moon. Except Viz. Viz is doing a very good job. <laughs> Kill it before it lays eggs. Okay, are you guys ready for this? You know he's gonna be in some like little speedo. Are you ready? I just need I need to know what pose he's in. Are you ready? Oh I can't! I can't. <laughs> To every fan of Tuxedo Cowboy. <laughs> oh my god. He looks like he's 12. <laughs> oh girl, no. <laughs> Is that Amy? <laughs> my fantasy. My fantasy is ruined. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm crying. This is <laughs> Oh, I was like, there's no shirt. There actually is. Oh my. <laughs> I thought, well, yeah, at least his clothes were, were, were fugly in the anime. <laughs> oh, I can't handle it. <laughs> oh, I've not laughed this hard in a long, long time. Oh, you guys, we have more outfits. <laughs> this is the first page. <laughs> I'd still tap that. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> if he wasn't a little boy before, <laughs> he's, <laughs> he's a little 
little boy wearing his daddy's clothes. This is like the flashback version. This is like, this is like the year after his parents died, and he's like <laughs> trying to find himself. <laughs> Woodbang. <laughs> Oh, this is the best stream I've ever done! There's no shirt! There's no shirt! Well, hey, well, hey, that, at least it's something like you'd wear in the anime! There's a page of just shoes! And they're like the same shoes that we've seen before! Oh, there we go! There we go! Now he's a Kung Kung Fu Master! What's with the jackets with no shirts?! What's with the jackets with no shirts? And like, what are th these are? <laughs> I am so glad I started with this dress up part. You guys, this is not the whole game. There's much more. 